Noob Noob, I heard you're super excited about a brand new sequel that's coming out. Pokemon. No. We're talking about Alf. The fuck is that? No, friends, we are not talking about ALF, the alien life form. We are talking about the greatest show that ended in the worst possible way ever. We're talking about Game of Thrones. We're talking about some Jon Snow and some breaking news. What do you think, Noob Noob? Uh, Game of Thrones is dead, so who cares? Is it, though? They're coming out with something about dragons. House of the Dragon is going to fail miserably. That shit looks dumb. I think fans are so angry about what they did to Game of Thrones that there's no way they are going to receive this well. Yeah. HBO doesn't really have anything else. Until Last of Us is a hit, then they're going to do like five spinoffs. Do you think it'll be a hit, though? I think it's going to vary from the source material so bad that it's not going to be a hit. I think it'll be a hit. Really? I think that maybe the first season they get away with, but anything after that, they're done. It depends what they do with the story. They're going to screw it up. You don't think they're going to screw that story up? Oh, probably. Yeah. You don't think HBO is going to screw this up? Just like they'll screw up this sequel series with him. What? Being There's King no of the material. North? There's was, yeah. That's what I mean. Like, what? What are they going to do? All people really want is for J.R.R. Tolkien to not Tolkien. Uh, J.R.R. What's his, that? Jack has his name. George uh, R.R. Martin. Yeah. There you go. George R. R. Martin to finish his story before he dies so they can all rest in peace. Everyone just wants the last two. What's it? Uh, Winds of Winter and Songs of Spring or something like that. Isn't Winds of Winter out? No. Oh. He never finished that book. And he's never going to finish that book. Because he's a bitch. So Kid Harrington is attached to reprise his fan favorite role in the first potential Thrones project. They already threw away one entire series starring Naomi Watts. That is true. Yeah, they spent like $30 million on the pilot and then we're like, nah. It was that bad. I would love to see it. Maybe Ugly Sonic's in it. I mean, everyone in that show is ugly now, so. In uh, what show? This show. Uh, This show or the new show? The new one. The new one. Yeah, there's no attractive people. Yeah. So the network has entered into an early development on its first sequel to the blockbuster fan. I mean, at least it's a sequel where you can like move forward and hope that there's stuff they haven't screwed up yet. Because when you when you run out of book material, these guys, the Benhoff and Weiss, were absolutely useless and couldn't finish a story. They went limp. Yeah, as long as they're not connected to it, I think it maybe at least will be halfway decent, but it probably won't be. Kit Harrington was twice nominated for an Emmy for his portrayal of an action hero who struggles to uphold his family's noble values. He was an action hero? Okay. In Thrones' eighth and final season, Snow discovered his true name was Aegon Targaryen. Targaryen. There you go. Potential heir to the Iron Throne. And then he was exiled. That's where we left him off. Spoiler alert, he's not dead, even though he should have died for reals. Because he did die for reals. In the books, yeah, he did die. Yeah. But now he did not die. And now he is exiled north of the wall for, like, what reason? What story could there possibly be to tell? He is going to be king of the north, and then he gets transitioned to queen of the south. He was also in Eternals. Unfortunately. And he was supposed to be the Black Knight. I'm pretty sure that's getting canceled now. It is definitely getting canceled. That is definitely not going. Maybe it'll be a Disney Plus show. Maybe. Moon Knight, Black Knight. I mean, he was actually supposed to be introduced in Moon Knight. And they cut that. Oof. Yeah, not so good. Right now, he's starring in Henry V on... on, uh, Yeah, in the National Theater's live production of Henry V. Whatever, man. (laughs) I'm more excited about this show than the House of the Dragon, at least. I think because it's something we don't know. Like, I don't need a prequel. I'm tired of prequels because prequels have no stakes. I already know what's going to happen to the character, so I don't care. And then they end up retconning a bunch of nonsense and making Obi-Wan look like a big wimp. Because he is. (laughs) Oh, okay. Yep, just like Kit Harrington's a big baby back bitch. 
So he's <laughs> they're gonna wreck on him as a big baby back. Oh yeah, he's gonna have a white walker come and just rail him in the ass. Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> okay. That's how it's gonna end. The fir the first episode is gonna end with him just getting pegged hard by a white walker. Wow. I'd be in. A if that's the trailer, I'm in. Okay. Right. Well, the development news on this series means there are seven Thrones projects in the works in addition to the upcoming House of Dragon prequel series. That's crazy. Uh, it's apparently House of the Dragon set 200 years be uh, uh, before the event of Thrones, which doesn't make a ton of sense, but sure. Apparently, there are other prequels in various stages of development. 10,000 ships. That doesn't sound good. Nine voyages? AK okay, I have to tell you the AKAs. Okay, it's 10,000 ships, AKA Nymeria. Excited about that? Nope. No. Nine voyages, AKA nope. the sea snake. <laughs> Dunk and egg. I have no idea what any of this shit is. I don't know is. what any of this is. Where's uh, the there dwarf are three show? animated prequel projects, including the Golden Please Empire. Please stop. <laughs> this is terrible. What are they doing to Game of Thrones? This is a disaster. Like we have nothing else. You're talking about Lord of the Rings, aren't you? Oh, you're gonna be so excited when they re when, when Amazon does that oh game. Oh my of god, the, or, yeah. Lord of the Woke. Lord of the Rings. <laughs> Lord of the Woke is Lord the, of woke. the Woke garbage. <laughs> oh, what a terrible idea! Plus, imagine they're gonna have like guest spots from Sansa Stark. She hasn't acted at all. Has she been in anything no, other than? No, she sucks and she's ugly. She's not ugly. They, you she's know what? Not attractive. You know what? Her, she's been starring as. Uh, one of the Jonas Brothers house whores. No, I was gonna say riding. She's been riding Joe Jonas's dong. Is it Joe Jonas? I, one of them. Some Jonas brother. She's been giving him babies. Yeah. She's popping out them babies, and then Arya has been getting. Uh, Real weird in the Sex Pistols show that no one watched, even though I, I'm pretty sure she's naked in it, she's but no still one a boy. cared. She's still a boy in your eyes. She is. <laughs> she's just a little boy in your eyes. Who uh, is there anybody else from that show that we care about? Millie no. Clark. She, they're all dead. Oh, yeah, her career's dead, too. They're, yeah. All their careers are dead. Jason Momoa? Eh, he, he hung it. Yeah, he's hanging out with Amber Turd. That's true. He, and he was barely her. in it. He was in the. You, you, no one would even know him if he wasn't banging Amelia Clark in that series. That's true. So, I don't know. I'm not excited. I don't think there's any source material for this. So, who knows what they're going to do? At least it could be a slightly original story, something. Because if they, any, anything they tied to the books turned into a disaster. Although, I'm sure George R.R. R. Martin, instead of finishing the books he already wrote, We'll write a new Jon Snow novel. Just whip it out so they can do one season of this and cancel it. So, anyway, I think uh, please, if you care for this type of content, like and subscribe. Share this with your friends and family, your loved ones. Because if you do not like and subscribe, there is a chance that Noob Noob, the White Walker that he is, could do this. I will eat endlessly until I become the size of Hodor. And come to a situation you in your life door? where I need to hold the door, and I won't. I'll shut that shit in your face. If you He'll don't slam that door right yeah. in your face. Yeah, I will commit to that as a as a method actor, just like Jared Leto. And says you used Hodor condoms. <laughs> so, with all the snow. I mean, those could be filled pretty heavily. Yep. Be prepared and, for that. Be prepared. Anyway, uh... Yes, please check us out. Check out our full-length audio podcast. It is free on all things Stitcher, Spotify, iTunes, all those great places, and more. And you can catch us live streaming right here on YouTube, Friday nights, 7.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Like, subscribe, do all those great things. We'll catch you on the next one because we are on to the next one.